In this demonstration, I would like to show you a few lesser known capabilities of word processing applications that are great tools for teachers. Specifically, I'm going to show you how to turn on track changes, how to insert comments, how to compare documents, and then how to review the revision history within Google Docs. First, let's talk about how to turn on track changes in Microsoft Word. This feature allows you to make edits and revisions to a document without permanently changing the original text. Instead, the changes are highlighted and can be reviewed by the author of the document. This is a great tool for teachers who want to provide feedback on student work without altering their original writing. To turn on this feature, go to the Review tab in Microsoft Word and click on Track Changes. Now, at the same time, you can also insert comments by highlighting the text you want to comment on and select New Comment. And I could say, please include a title. So, these comments can be used to address more higher level issues that language learners have. The next aspect that I would like to show is to compare documents. Comparing documents allows you to see what changes have been made between two versions of a document. To compare documents in Microsoft Word, go to the Review tab and click on Compare Documents. Now, oftentimes, I find that students will tell you that they have made a lot of changes from the first draft to the second draft, and that is sometimes not the case. With Microsoft Word, you can actually compare the first draft and the second draft. So, I have student text one, and then the revised document student text version 2. As you can see, the student deleted a few words here, added some words here. So, there was really not much in terms of changes that the student implemented between the first and the second version. Finally, let's talk about how to review the revision history within Google Docs. This feature allows you to see all of the changes that have been made to a document over time. To access the revision history in Google Docs, go to File and then Version History and select See Version History. From there, you can see all of the changes that have been made to the document, who made them and when they were made. So, if you have a writing collaborative assignment that includes multiple authors, you can actually tell who made the changes to the document. I find this particularly useful for writing instruction. Overall, these tools are great for teachers who want to provide feedback on student work, track changes over time, and monitor the revision history of a document. By using these tools, teachers can help students improve their writing skills and provide more effective feedback.